Hello everyone. Today we are going to talk about different types of transmission modes that we use in communication. Transmission mode defines the direction of the flow of information between two communication devices over a network. It's also called data communication or data transmission. Networks are developed to allow communication to occur between individual devices that are interconnected. In OSI model, physical layer is dedicated to data transmission in the network. It mainly decides the direction of data in which data needs to travel to reach the destination. There are three types of transmission modes. Simplex mode. In simplex mode, only one of the two devices on a link can transmit data. The other can only receive. Simplex mode can use the entire bandwidth of the channel to send data in one direction. In this mode, a sender can only send data but cannot receive it. Similarly, a receiver can only receive data but cannot send it. It is mainly used in business field, particularly in sales that don't require any corresponding reply. In this mode, communication is unidirectional, where we just send a command or signal and do not expect any response back. It can be thought of as a one-way road in which traffic travels only in one direction. No vehicle coming from the opposite direction is allowed to drive through. Take a keyboard and monitor. Relationship is an example. Keyboard can only send the input to the monitor and the monitor can only receive the input and displays it on the screen. Monitor cannot reply or send any feedback to the keyboard. Other examples include fire alarm, loudspeakers, television broadcasting, computer to printer, scanner to computer and radio transmission work the same way. We cannot send a message back to them. Half duplex mode. In this mode, each device can transmit and receive data, but not at the same time. When one device is sending, the other can only receive. And when the second device is sending, the other can only receive. Half duplex is used in cases where there is no need for communication in both directions at the same time. However, data can be transmitted in both directions but only in one direction at a time. That means half duplex support two-way traffic, but in only one direction at a time. The entire bandwidth of the channel can be utilized for each direction. Halfway duplex is still considered a one-way road in which a vehicle traveling in the opposite direction of the traffic has to wait till the road is empty before it can pass through. In half duplex, it is possible to perform error detection and if any error occurs then receiver requests the sender to transmit the data. For example, on a local area network using a technology that has half duplex transmission such as hub where one device can send data on the line and then immediately receive data on the line from the same direction in which data was just transmitted. Hence, half duplex transmission represents bidirectional line that can carry data in both directions, but data can be sent in only one direction at a time. Walkie talkie is the best example of half duplex, where speakers at both ends can speak, but they have to speak one by one. They cannot speak simultaneously. Intercom also works in half duplex mode. It can send and receive message at any given time. It cannot do both at the same time. Many computer modems and internet browser fall in this category. Full duplex mode. In computing networks, when there is a flow of information in both ways, from sender to receiver at the same time is known as full duplex. We can send data in both directions as it is bidirectional at the same time. In other words, data can be sent in both directions simultaneously. Full duplex has two simplex channels. One channel has traffic moving in one direction and other channel has traffic flowing in the opposite direction. In simple words, there can be two lines, one for sending data and the other for receiving data. 
you can say full duplex transmission mode is a two way road in which traffic can go both ways at the same time full duplex is used when communication in both directions is required all the time full duplex has double bandwidth as compared to half duplex capacity of the channel however is divided between two directions full duplex is considered the fastest mode of communication between devices the most common example of full duplex is a telephone network when two people are communicating with each other by a telephone line both can talk and listen at the same time all right so this brings me to the end of my video thanks for watching please subscribe